Good morning, y'all. Been waiting to hear back from Dad. Um, I've called him like 14 times, and he never answered. That's the thing about him, though. He never answers the phone. He's always doing something, so can never get him on the phone. But he finally texted me and said he was up at the land working, which I figured he was going to do today. So I'm going to go help him. But first, I've got to take my baby Murrow to my grandmother's house. Yeah, because he gets into everything. And, which I texted him something else, I can't remember, and he didn't answer my question, and instead he just put black rifle coffee. So in other words, he wants me to bring him a coffee. <laughs> so I'm going to grab some of those out of the refrigerator real quick and go up there and see if I can help him a little bit today. Appreciate y'all. Taking him to my grandmother's and he's fussy this morning, ain't you, bud? Yeah. Mm. Oh my. Oh my. I'm in my driveway. So. My goodness. You got it so rough, Merle. Alright, so being the wonderful, sweet daughter I am, I am bringing Padre a whole case of the cold black raffle coffees to, oh, yeah, my driveway is terrible, to put in the refrigerator of the house there that we're remodeling and one cold one in the new flavor. Ugh. Espresso Rich Mocha. As always, you, uh, you can use my code Hannah15 for 15% off Black Rifle Coffee orders. If you order online at their store, you can get these things from gas stations and stuff too. But that is if you order online at the Black Rifle Coffee store. Appreciate y'all. So, he's already got the whole roof off the porch. And we've been taking the screws and stuff out from the end of the porch because it was a little crooked and he couldn't stand it. So, <laughs> so, so I've been taking all that off and he cut it straight. And don't it look good? The whole way. Oh, yeah, it's all straight and pretty and stuff now. Straight. It was out to there, but we're taking that off so it'll be straight. And gonna redo that took the steps off this side because as y'all can see this is a little crooked too yeah, just, a little bit. just a little bit <laughs> so redoing that side too and did we did you decide if you're gonna put the steps in the middle or back on the side i don't know, I don't know yet on that but we got all the rafters cut out there i cut all the rafters and the lab so all that's cut so all we got to do is take I was going to use these posts right here, but they crooked in the dog's back leg, so I'm going to have to do something. I'm going to have to do something different than I was going to set. Instead of putting them every, these were, what, every six foot, I guess, down through here? I'm going to put them every 12 foot, you know, sort of stretch them out a little bit. That way mm -hmm. the posts are just not so close together, probably. I'm, got, I'm putting them every six foot underneath here where they were, but... Um, I'm just gonna put the post to hold the beams up for the for the porch ceiling. Um, yeah. Every 12 foot, skip one in the middle. And there'll be five poles. I was gonna use those, but they're just too crooked. Too so, crooked. And material right now is just super. So expensive. Stupid it's, expensive. It's stupid right now. I mean, so he's been on the sawmill a lot, even cutting two befores. Yeah. And he doesn't. He, cut two before. No. But as much as they cost now, he's kind of had they're to. A dollar, they're over a dollar a foot for two before. Yeah. That's and crazy. We ain't been doing a lot of step-by-step -step recording today like we usually do. Just because we've been jamming out over the speaker. And you can't put, you know, copyrighted music in YouTube videos. Because you'll get in trouble. Which is understandable. Because, I mean, that's artist music. That's how they make their living. So, yeah. So, we've been jamming out. And that's why we hadn't been getting, you know, videos of everything, but doing some updates for y'all, so. Yep. 
Yep. And the inside, I think the last video I showed y'all was when we were getting the walls up and everything. The whole kitchen's been ripped out. The, the refrigerator's still in here. I had to bring in all these this morning to put in here. And I got a water somewhere, but I can't remember where I put it. And, yep, got the walls up on the inside. Bathroom here. There wasn't a bathroom inside at all when we started. It was just, I say we, I hadn't hardly done anything, but dad's been working pretty hard on it all. Um, this was just a one room house. Kitchen was over there. There was no walls. And then there was a bed over here. So added some walls and a bathroom on the inside. There was a bathroom outside, but that is not my cousin's house. So he can have an outhouse. Here's the bedroom. This is where all the tools are right now too, but, and the closet over there. And yes, I'm rolling in my Walmart overalls today. Yeah. on some of my posts say something about me done in the people that, that built, did the building. Hey, listen, I'm not saying anything bad about the people that did the building. Yeah. Okay. You know. To each their own. Yeah. It's just me. I'm, I'm. He is a that? super perfectionist. He I, has a little bit of OCD when it comes to building stuff. <laughs> as soon as she quits videoing, I'm going to kick her in the butt. But anyway. Not saying anything about their building. It's just that he, I couldn't. That's, he, he builds houses for a living. So, yeah, so he has a certain way that he wants stuff done. And yeah, he has the ability to make it that way. So yeah. why but, not? But not saying anything bad about the construction. Because the actual construction, the materials that were used were, were awesome. Yeah. Just, just tweaking it a little bit. Yeah. Just tweaking it just a little bit. Just yeah. a little bit. So anyway. Y'all don't get on to me because I'm not saying anything about the dude that did the work right here. It's all good. Yeah. We just adding some stuff. It's right here. I love this thing. Everybody needs one of these. Woohoo! Everybody needs one of those. That's the only way to go. <laughs> My poor little truck out there. I need to I need to fix the gas lid thing that won't stay closed. Nah, I just bad. That's character. Not, yeah, but I I get tired of people stopping me saying your gas lid's open. Yeah, I know it's broke. Yeah. Yeah. It'll be alright. Right. But if y'all remember from the last video, I was about to walk y'all outside where the outside bathroom was. We took it out because my cousin wanted it because he wanted him an out and he wanted him an outhouse. So we took that out, gave it to him. I missed that. I think that's on Dad's YouTube channel on them actually moving that thing to my cousin's house. That should be interesting. I need to go watch that because I hadn't even seen it. Um, but yeah, that's what we're doing today. And like you said, we ain't. We ain't saying nothing bad about the folks who had this place or lived here. We're just tweaking it up a little bit to his standards. So, hope y'all have a good one and appreciate y'all.